What did you hear about both faith? God loves both faith, and both faith brings about answered prayers. A prayer offered in faith will heal the sick person. James chapter 5. Before we talk about both faith and what it is, we need to talk about what it is not. Number one, both faith is not about performance or religious activities. Sometimes it might feel like if I do enough work in church, if I participate enough, if I go to church more frequently, maybe I might deserve God's favor. Or if I give enough money, God would answer my prayers and do what I wish Him to do. But that has nothing to do with both faith to God. In Luke chapter 7, the Jewish people came to Jesus bringing the request of the centurion whose servant was sick. When they came to Jesus, they pleaded earnestly with him. This man deserves to have you do this because he loves our nation and has built our synagogue. Now, this is all built around religious activity. He has built a synagogue for them. So now they feel like he deserves God's goodness. And this is like the picture of you being a believer who tells God, I come to church every day to sweep. I am doing this and that for you. Somehow, why are my prayers not answered? Why are you not doing the things that I asked you to do? Since I'm doing what I was told you asked me to do, but that was religion. Religion might have told you, come and sweep the church and then God will answer your prayers. Come and do this, give money and bring this. But that's not both faith. If you're a Christian, praying to God as a return on investment for the things that you've invested into the kingdom, so to say, as you were told by the church, that is not faith. You should not base your faith on your performance or your religious activities. Number two, what both faith is not, is not based on position or status. Jairus, the ruler of the synagogue, his daughter was sick to death. And Jairus went to Jesus, pleaded with Jesus to come to his house to heal the daughter. And based on his position, somehow it could have been that Jesus should have healed the daughter so Jairus is someone that has position, the ruler of the synagogue of the Jews. Along the way, as Jesus was going to Jairus' house, a woman with the issue of blood who had no status, who was not even supposed to go out, came and received a healing from Jesus. That shows both faith is not about status. Now Jesus had to speak to Jairus, hearing that his daughter has died. Hearing this, Jesus said to Jairus, Don't be afraid, just believe and she will be healed. It wasn't about, based on your position, I will heal her. It's believe and she will be healed. Number three, both faith is not about long hours of prayers. And I have nothing against praying for a long time or for long hours or for days. Praying for long hours should be about intimacy with God. But if you are going to God with your knee, and then you feel like if you put in enough hours, God is going to answer you. That is not both faith. You are mistaken. You are getting it wrong. And building intimacy with Him is actually what brings you to a place of having confident faith. Number four, both faith is not about seeing to believe. The systems of the world that we live in is counter the kingdom of God. Because the world talks about seeing is believing, but that is not true. In line with faith and in line with God, seeing is not believing. Because what you see there is more to what your eyes can see. Faith is not about the physical. Faith is about the things that you've not seen that through God's Spirit, it can be brought to life. Faith calls those things that be not as though they are. Which means, in the beginning, like God called light out of darkness, if you have a situation and the facts that you see are not in line with what you want, it's for you to call forth what you want in faith that God will make it happen. Because faith does not need evidence for it to happen. Because it has God as its only evidence. It has God's faithfulness and His power as an evidence that what I pray for, what I believe for, will come true. Number five, both faith is not feelings. Sometimes you could pray about something and then you don't feel it. It's not about what you feel, it's about what God says. So your feelings will not always be in line with God's word. Your feelings will not always be in line with God's will until you align with God for His desires to be placed on your heart. But until then, your feelings will never be the measure for your faith. So if you allow what you feel to be the measure for your faith, then you will not be able to operate in both faith, whereby you can see results in your prayers. Number six, both faith does not deny fact or reality, but it believes God to override those facts and realities. Thank you so much for watching this video. 
this is my youtube channel i am uem akwan please subscribe to this channel and give this video a thumbs up don't forget to share this video to others who may need to see this when you give this video a thumbs up it's going to help youtube share it to others for them to see and be blessed also do not forget to keep up with this channel god bless you bye 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 <laughs>